Yeah, so uh, the next thing that we're going to uh, let you listen to is a 18-year-old client that I worked with um, over the past three to four months. And one of the things that he's going to talk about is his father's addiction and how that affected him. So when he was 14 years old, he walked in on his father looking at pornography. And for four years, he kept that secret, not telling anybody until he came to therapy. And I want you to notice um, what he, he, you're actually going to hear him describe what that was like for him. And this is him as an 18-year-old talking about four years ago. But notice the double messages. Notice how he speaks about his father who can't really deal with relational issues and pushes them off onto the mother. When I was 14 years old, I stayed up late. Um, in my house, and I, th I caught my dad looking at porn. At least, uh, it looked like it. And then, when I confronted him about it, he told me, like, he said he wasn't, and he made up some excuse, and and then. Uh, like a year later, I actually caught him in the act, and he said he'd stop, and everything like that, but he didn't, and and it's just affected me, my family, negatively the whole time. I feel like he's, I don't know, more distant emotionally from the family. He doesn't, he, he's not there for most of us. He's always, he's either, when he's not at work, he's either sleeping or on his iPhone. And It's just so stressful. I feel like he pushes all the all all the problems that he that in, he encounters on someone else, mostly my mom. And so much trouble. We try to help. Okay, you could feel the pain in this uh, in this young man's life.